All right, finally getting back into Zelda with Phantom Hourglass. Now, this game, I, I, I kind of, I, like, people seem to like consider this game one of the weaker entries in the series, and I can kind of understand why. I mean, I don't dislike it, but I find it more forgettable than anything. Like, like even though I'm like replaying this now, I don't remember a lot of the plot points actually. I have a vague remembrance of what happens. I mean, I played through it before, but I just don't remember a lot about it. I, I don't know why. For some reason, it's just very forgettable to me. So, I mean, uh, and unfortunately, I didn't get any uh, name suggestions, so I just um, uh, kept my name from Wind Waker. Named him Kid again. After all this time, no one remembers his name or bothered to ask. So there, we, there we go. Poor kid. No one knows what his name is. No one cares. Oh well. And I'm not really sure how long this is supposed to take place after Wind Waker. I guess it doesn't really matter. I assume within a year. I don't know. Everyone looks the same. Oh well. But yeah. But uh, and one thing I should keep. I should. Uh, you should keep in mind is I'm playing this on an emulator, so things are a little bit clumsy at times. Uh, like the controls for me, I like. I don't. You know, I can't use a stylus. Like I use my mouse. I'm really not used to it. It's a little bit awkward. So I'm not. I'm not. Uh, so there's gonna be a little bit of awkwardness uh, as I try to do combat and stuff. And there's a link. Well, that's not how it happened. Tetra got kidnapped by that giant bird and got dropped in. It wasn't that pleasant? This story is inaccurate. I want my money back. Ah well. That didn't happen either, except they kind of went to Forsaken Fortress together, but that's pretty much it. Ah, oh, shit, moving the story along really fast. Oh, well. But yeah, um, it is, it is always nice to have a direct sequel to a Zelda game, because that doesn't happen too often. There's, uh, let's see, well, there's Zelda, and then Zelda 2 for the NES. Well, I don't know, does Oracle's, do the Oracle games count? I've never actually played those. Are those, like in the same setting. I don't really know how, how that works, to be perfectly honest. And there's Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask. And then there's this. I mean, like, a direct sequel with, like, the same Link involved. That doesn't happen very often. It's always nice when it does. I still kind of want to do an have another game with Twilight Princess Link. That'd be nice. Ah, well. Hey, maybe one day. Maybe one day. Because I remember, uh... Like, they said, like, Minna would come back to the series if there was demand for it, and there has been, but, I don't know. And this never happened either. He never climbed mountains. This is inaccurate. I don't like it. And he didn't stab Gandorf in the dick either. Ah, oh, well. He stabbed him right in the fucking skull. Ah, oh, well. But, uh, yeah, yeah. I, I wouldn't mind another game with White Princess. Like, and Minna, because, I mean, I know she's in Hyrule Warriors, but that's, I, I'm pretty, that's not canon. That's like just kind of like a for funsies sort of game, right? As far as I know, it's not supposed to be canon in any sort of way. So I'm not sure if I should really count that. And isn't she, wasn't she a DLC character anyway? I don't know. I've never played that game. I want to, though. I, actually, actually, after uh, Spirit Tracks, I think I'll probably do a playthrough of that game. Yeah, this is still going. It's almost done. Hooray! Higher, uh, happy Pirate Endings. Your story sucks. It was inaccurate. I want my money back. Bah. <laughs> I did, actually. <laughs> How did he go through that whole story without realizing he was a, he was asleep? <laughs> they, just don't, just, they just don't give a shit about his name. They never ask. They never remember. Poor, uh, what's his face? Just gonna go kick the shit out of him. Oh shit, just gonna kick him while he's down. Oh. Never mind. Yeah, but like, I, like I'm struggling to remember some of the plot points in this game. And like, like the fairy companion has her memories lost. I don't remember what the payoff of that is. Like what her, what the memories are. I, I don't remember. Like I can't remember a lot of the temple. The one thing I do remember is going through that fucking Ocean King temple 20 million times. But whatever. But this game has line back, so I forgive any faults it might have. <laughs> Kid, are you okay? It looks like dazed. I think he's sick or something. Oh, well. 
Yeah, I don't know. I, I feel like they should have released. They should have just made this a console game. To be perfectly honest, I don't know. Like, the graphic style it just doesn't look too good. I mean, I know it's not supposed to look as good as Wind Waker because it's on the DS, but still, I don't know. Man, I'm just being picky. Oh. Yeah, it's weird. They don't. No one believes in like the ghost ship, even though uh, the kid in green, whatever his name is, he he went in there. Yeah, see, look, yeah, she doesn't believe in it. <laughs> the kid went in there. He got a, a treasure sharp, uh, chart from there. Like, come on. I don't think there are rules. More like guidelines. But Yeah, after all the shit Tetra's gone through, it's like, there are no ghost ships or ocean kings. That's silly. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, no. Yo, it's, it's scary. I don't like it. Oh. oh no. We're all gonna die. Maybe. I don't know. I thought they were, they were looking for Hyrule or a new place to build a new kingdom to forget Hyrule. Not just see the world. Oh no. Hmm. That's weird. Well, yes, that. The ship is weird, yes, but. Uh, while I was playing this, the the sound was all clippy and annoying, but now it's crystal clear. Huh. Weird. Oh well. Hey, that's a good thing. I mean, I don't know. I mean, yeah, well, like, like, while I was playing, it was like irregularly horrible. Like this musical part here, there was all sorts of sound clipping going on. I had no idea what the hell was happening. I just assumed because I was doing it in an emulator, but fine now. I don't know. Yeah, there's no crew on board. Oh, come on, there's no crew on board. Come on. Yeah, come on, Tetra. Where's your imagination? You already went it down and discovered the ruins of Hyrule in an air pocket done by magic. You can't believe in a ghost ship? Oh, she's dead. Well, <laughs> I, guess, I guess Nico's the new captain. Let's keep sailing. Uh, uh, something happened. I can't, can't see. Oh shit. Yeah, where the hell is his sword and shield? And where's that little, um, King of Red Lions boat he had at the end of the game? I don't know. I guess it broke. Oh, you suck. You can't even do one pull up? I know you did that shit. You did that shit all the time in Wind Waker. Man, he's been slacking on his training. He sucks. I hope he drowns. Uh, whatever his name is. Yeah, so that was fast. It like took like what five minutes, and she's already kidnapped. Eight minutes, roughly. God damn, it's like a new record. Not even a Minish Cap Zelda got kidnapped. Well, not really kidnapped, but turned to stone this quickly. Huh? <laughs> Save me, whatever her name is. That doesn't exactly give me very good incentive to go try and save you if you can't remember my name. Oh no. No! Uh, don't do that. Uh, why? Like, why did they. Why did they use Navi sound clips for this fairy? Like, what? Why? <laughs> what were they thinking? <laughs> Like, I'm one of those people that actually doesn't even really mind Navi that much, but it's like, but why? It, it, it's just weird. There's no point to it. I don't think she even, like, did she even do it again after this cutscene? I don't remember. So what's even the point? Yeah, like, the sh yeah, the shadow's still all glitchy. I don't, I don't know if it's usually like that or if it's because of the emulator. It's been a long time since I played this on the DS. So... Yeah, it, yeah, you know what I think about it? It's kind of weird. Like, I usually associate Link with traveling with fairies, but it, it doesn't happen very often. Ocarina of Time, Majora's Mask, this game, that's pretty much it, really. I mean, fairy-like companions, maybe. Like, Fi, sort of, but not quite. He's a sword spirit or something. Minna's a weird imp creature. <laughs> the King of Red Lions is a boat. Well, he doesn't really travel along with Link, so that doesn't really count. Yeah. 
Yeah, I don't know. You gotta count all the palm trees for uh, a puzzle. Yeah, I actually went, um, you know, just to test things out, I actually went along and, uh, like, recorded, like, an hour or so beforehand and then re-recorded for this with the name intact. So I was just making sure how many palm trees there were. I, I, I didn't actually remember that puzzle. But, yeah, see, like, it, it gets a little awkward. I'm using the mouse instead of the stylus, so it's just something that has to be dealt with. Really, no way of working around it. Yeah, and she mentioned like her memories. I believe. Yeah, I, th I think she mentioned her memories. I don't remember what the payoff with that is. Like, what what the deal is? What like what memories she's forgetting? I don't recall at all. <laughs> like, I'm pretty sure it gets revealed. Why would they bring up a point like that and not have it uh mean you know uh mean anything? See, is it Celia? I assume that's how it's pronounced. It doesn't really matter, I'll just call her the fairy. She's not important enough for her name to be remembered. I don't know, I actually do like, kind of like it when Link has a companion going along with him. I mean, you know, they're not always th that great, like Navi. Like, I, I don't hate Navi, but I don't particularly care for her. And Fi was god-awful, but Minna was okay, I liked her. And I, I don't remember hating Ciela. Uh, Ciela? So, yeah. I mean, she has more personality than Davi does, so I. and Fi, so I guess she's fine. Tattle was okay. She was kind of more brass and sarcastic. She was fine. And, uh, I don't remember if any, like, the like old 8 bit 2D, or, you know, not 8 bit, but. the old 2D Zelda game. I don't think Link ever had any companions in those, did he? Like, yeah, I've never played the Oracle games, so I don't know about those. I actually am looking forward to playing those one day for the, the for the channel. I've been curious about them, but I've just never gotten around to it. Yeah, I, I do like Lineback though; he's pretty great. I, I remember him being good. I I, I remember liking him because he's such a lovable douchebag. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but yeah, this game, I just. A lot of it I forgot about. Like, I can't remember any temples at all. Except for the Temple of the Ocean King. Aside from that, I don't remember what any of the temples are like. I mean, well, actually, I did get to the fire one in my, like, test recording. But I don't, I don't remember what it was like in there, what the boss is. And I, I assume there's probably a water temple. There pretty much always is. Probably some sort of grass-themed temple, too, somewhere. Pro maybe an ice temple? I don't know. Yeah, but I, I remember a little bit more about Spirit Tracks in this game. I, I just remember because uh, Zelda as a ghost or as a disembodied spirit travels along with you, and I thought that was kind of neat. She's probably uh, yeah, like Spirit Tracks Zelda is like one of the most like has like the most characterization of like any Zelda. It's weird. I mean, it's in a game that people kind of overlook and don't really care about, you know. Yeah, I mean Link is usually lacking character but Zelda's guy has that same problem too most Zelda incarnations are pretty boring really Twilight Princess Zelda is probably the worst she's such a bore she doesn't do anything she does nothing of interest until like the final battle and all she does is just shoot light arrows which I mean that's yeah that's fine yeah that wasn't in that big of an earthquake it lasted like two seconds bridge is flimsy I mean, whoever built that bridge needs to be fired and replaced. You can't build shit. <laughs> Alright, I guess we'll just have to wait a couple of hours. Yeah, I'll just I'll just uh, break pots for a couple of hours and then uh, maybe the uh, bridge will be uh, rebuilt. Oh well. Shouldn't they just wipe out all the monsters? Yeah well. I mean, it's a small island. It can't take that long. And there are the choo-choos, which I still think look kind of like old-school Homestar Runner. You know, back when, you know, back when we had the more round head and stuff. Like, from, the, like, the first couple of Flash cartoons. Oh, well, that sucks. What, what, the, the earthquake lasted, like, a second. How is there so much damage being done? What the hell? Oh, well. <laughs> Bully the chicken. Or the cuckoo. 
Oh, I, I scramble its poor brains by throwing a rock at it. Oh, you cheap bastard. <laughs> I do like the idea of the kid actually giving him a dirty look for that. It's a weird thing to imagine, because he's usually so happy-go-lucky. I know, I liked Toon Link. I know a lot of people didn't, at least at first. Uh, but I don't know, I liked him. I just love how expressive he is, or a little, a little bit more in Wind Waker. I don't recall him being quite as expressive in uh, Fan Hourglass or Spirit Drags, but... I don't know, I wouldn't mind going back to Toon Link one more time for a console release, not handheld. It's something for a Switch, but I don't know. They're probably going to stick with, like, Breath of the Wild type graphics for a while. I don't know. But, which, they aren't bad. It's just, I, I, I wouldn't mind having Toon Link again or Twilight Princess type graphics. I liked those. A little bit, maybe, like, some people thought they were a little bit too gritty, too edgy. But I don't know, I liked them. It was a nice change of pace. I like it more than the pseudo cartoonish, pseudo realistic. Well, not really realistic, but like, like a mix of like normal and cartoony, like how Skyward Sword was. I don't really know how to, how to how to uh, describe it because it's not really cartoony, but it's not quite Twilight Princess levels either. It's I don't really know how to describe it. It's slightly cartoony. I don't know. And thankfully the. Old oh, man just so happens to have a sword. Yeah, his storehouse for his one item. The sword. <laughs> wow, why does he need this big ass storehouse for a one item? Jeez. Yeah, and I actually do like some of the stuff they do with the uh, stylus. A lot of the puzzles, you just gotta write, you know, patterns on the screen. And I remember the one puzzle where you gotta close the DS screen to like stamp something. Um, and I, I remember that being kind of clever. Yeah. Yeah, because it doesn't have the Master Sword anymore. That shit's at the bottom of the ocean. Fi and Gandorf are just intertwined with each other for all eternity. Poor Gandorf. <laughs> He's suffering. Ganondorf, there's an 80% chance that that fish is a sunfish. Oh, God. <laughs> Let me tie. Well, I don't know why a sunfish would be at the bottom of the ocean, but whatever. And the shadows are... Yeah, there's got to be graphical glitches. There's really not much I can do there. I mean, at least the audio glitches from the, you know, the ghost ship scene doesn't seem to carry over to to the recording for some reason, so whatever. I'll take it. Yeah, so this is where things get a little bit difficult, because I'm using the mouse. Yeah, the sword play isn't going to be too good. I'll, I try my darndest, but it's just not enough. Yeah, but thankfully there is the, like, the homing attack sort of thing. Yeah, the targeted attack. Thankfully I got that, so... Uh, so I, I could, I'll, you know, just use that most of the time because I, I just can't get the, like the regular swipes to really work properly, eh. or the side slash, whatever. And for some reason, I just have a lot of difficulty with it. Like I, I, yeah, I, I, of course, I blame the, you know, the, having to use the mouse. Yeah, it took me like a couple try. I just wanted to attack him because I knew he would, yeah, he would have something funny to say. Didn't even mean to do a spin dash. That was an accident. Yeah, yeah. It's like, sorry. Like, you'll have to just. It's something that I, I, I just have to deal with, you know. With the. Eh, they did it all right the last two times at least. And the spin, the spin attack's not too bad with the mouse. So, thankfully, that's uh, not. Yeah, that's not too bad. Not as bad as the regular attack. So I'll, I'll, I'll just try to use the targeted attack as much as I can. Yeah, like this this is gonna be like a challenge. This is gonna be a challenge. Playing this on the emulator, man. I don't. I've never done that before. Like I said, I actually do have a physical copy of the game, but I I just don't really know how to. I I don't really have any way of recording DS footage. So, is this or nothing? And I actually kind of did want to revisit this game because it's been so long. Yeah, think about it. I I think I may. Wait, did I? Oh, I missed that. I didn't even pick up that blue rupee. Oh well. Yeah, what's with the gossip stones with the mustache? The big Wario mustaches. I like it actually. But can I bomb them and make them rocket up into the sky? That's the real question. 
What the hell are- aren't Gossip Shones a Sheikah thing? Why are they all the way out here anyway? Oh well. Well then again, these these things don't have the eye of the Sheikah on them like the ones in Ocarina of Time do. But then again, I'm putting too much thought into this. More than Nintendo is, that's for sure. I, I put too much thought into the Zelda series sometimes, I know. But, oh well. Like, why is, it, why is there Sheikah stuff in um, Termina, in Majora's Mask, when there's no Sheikah? Yeah, the, there's the Gossip Stones. It, it, wasn't the Lens of Truth a Sheikah thing? I don't know. But the Gossip Stone, the Mask of Truth, yeah, that's definitely Sheikah stuff, but it's in Termina where there are no Sheikah. Weird. Yeah, I know, I overthink stuff, but, yeah, I don't know. I had fun with it. Yeah. Oh. Thank you, helpful rock. Who put these blocks here anyway? This is some abandoned cave that no one goes into. Yeah, why 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 is there this lever system? Why are there locked doors? I mean it's just bats and rats anyway. Bah. Yeah, I probably should have written it on the map because I accidentally get it out of order. Oh well. Yeah, and the glitchy shadow. Yeah, I, I I don't remember if it was like that on the DS, like the physical DS or not, or if it's just an emulator thing, but... Oh well, there's really not much I can do about it. At least it's only affecting shadows and not like, you know, the kid himself or the enemies or any other NPCs. At least not so far. Yeah, it's all running a lot smoother than I remember the DS emulator being able to handle. Because I remember like, you know, like... I remember using the emulator in the past. I remember things being a lot more uh, laggy and janky, you know? Ooh, a red ruby. Yeah, I don't remember if you even have to upgrade your wallet in this game, because I get over 100 rupees in this video. I mean, there's there's actually a rupee worth 100 that I get near the end of it. In that tree that the guy told me about. So yeah, I don't, I don't remember if there are wallet upgrades or not. Or if you could just... I mean, thinking about it, he should have the biggest wallet already, but whatever. Yeah, where's all his stuff? I, oh, I, I guess it did get washed away when he fell. How very convenient. All his gear just so happened to not be with him. Yeah, who set up this trap? What the fuck's going on in this place? Like, this isn't a temple. It's just a cave. It was probably Oceus. He's probably just a sick bastard. Your grandpa's an asshole, Ciela. I don't know. I, I don't know how to pronounce her name. If I had to guess, I would say it's Ciela. That's how I'll pronounce it. I, I don't really know. You're yeah, so anyway, your grandpa's a fucking dick, Ciela. Ocious. Ah, rat. Kill it. <laughs> you know, it's probably not a good thing that this kid's going around slaughtering small mammals with a sword. Just saying. Uh, that's some serial killer shit right there. That's not that's not healthy. Shouldn't be doing that. That's not good. Yeah, I, I had a lot of trouble clicking on that fucking thing. Ugh, boy. Like I almost died to these rats. Actually, I get like to, like down to like half a health. Or do I? I don't know. I I, I take more damage than I should against these things. It's a little embarrassing. But I'll, I'll persevere. I'll get through. No matter what. Yeah, this was I, I, this was a clever little little mechan or puzzle. I go a little bit more to the right, but yeah, I, I don't think uh, slaughtering small animals uh, with a sword is a good childlike behavior. It's gonna, it's gonna grow up to uh, like it's gonna grow up to like strangle women or something like that. It's, it's not gonna be good in his adult years. <laughs> I don't fucking know. There's nothing else to talk about. Leave me, up, leave me be. I, I'm not the one going around slaughtering rats. Don't look at me like that. Uh, or, or chucking giant boulders at bats either. That's pretty fucked up too. I mean, God damn, he's strong. Look, look, those boulders are like as big as he is. How much do those things weigh? Christ. I don't know. Every link is just superhuman, I guess. I don't know. The Breath of the Wild one can climb up mountains with his bare hands. Unless it's raining. It fucking rain. Yeah, I, I want to do Breath of the Wild too on this channel, but it's such a long fucking game. My god. 
Like, I want to do it 100%. Those Korok seeds could go fuck themselves. But I'd have to at least do all the shrines, at least. I, I you know, I'd, ha I'd have to at least do those. But I don't know. That's a, a lot of ground to cover. Eh. Yeah, it's kind of weird how the ghost ship was just a small side... Well, not even a side thing. It was actually part of the main story. But it was it was still kind of, like, inconsequential. And Wind Waker is just like, oh, gotta go into the ghost ship, get, get this uh, chart, and then it's never mentioned again. But now it's like actually like a big, important part to the main story. Like like the entire like main story revolves around this ghost ship. It's a little unusual. I mean, I, I don't mind it. It's kind of it's interesting, but I don't know. What you got, old lady? Uh, I didn't ask for your opinion, lady. I'll do whatever I want. I'm a free spirit. I don't have any parents. They're dead, so I can do whatever I want. Grandma's back at Alset Island. And he just gives a shit about them. Oh, yeah. I wonder how the grandma and Errol are doing, huh? <laughs> yeah, they're one family member ditched them to go explore the world. Or, I mean, it was supposed to go to look for a new kingdom, but now it's just to explore, so I don't know. Yeah, I don't remember what these are for, actually. Like, I know that, that's like, um, is that for Roar's Mark or, uh, uh, wait a minute. Is that for Roar's Mark or is that Dens on that little pearl thing there? I think it's a pearl, right? I, I don't remember what they're for, actually. I really don't, but I can't afford it for a while anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Yeah, I know, I, I probably should, no, like, no, 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 I think, I think for Roar's like a spiral, isn't it? I don't know, because I remember the Kokiri Emerald, but... No, that's the Kokiri, then. I don't know. It kind of looks like... It kind of looks like wind. It for war's kind of about wind. I don't know. Ah, well, I'll... I'll find out at some point. I, I, I really should know these things. I, I really feel like I should. But whatever. Yeah, and that's another thing. I, I always love the milk is alcohol thing. I think it kind of started in Majora's Mask, didn't it? With the milk bar? Yeah, but that, I mean, that game's milk bar. And the uh, Shiatu, sh Shitu, Romani, I don't know how it's pronounced. It's just alcohol. Alcohol, uh, uh, milk. And, yeah, there's, there's that really fucked up scene where Creamia's, like, gonna drug her sister with the alcoholic milk at the end of the third day so she won't, like, be, like, aware of things when the moon falls. God damn, I love that game so fucking much. It's so tragic. All, all creation, huh? Where, where the fuck was he when Gandalf was running around the Great Sea then? Lazy bastard. Didn't do a damn thing to help. <laughs> yeah, so who cursed the place? I, I don't remember. Was it the main villain of this game? I, I, I sincerely don't remember how it got cursed. Yeah, I assume it was the main villain of this game. I mean, I guess I, I, I guess it's kind of late for it, but about spoiler warnings, I guess, but... I don't really remember too much about the main story so I, to spoil, so... I, I do remember one big plot point that I, I, I guess I won't spoil... I don't know. It, it, uh, I, I guess I just won't bother, and here's the 100 rupees. Fucking nice. All right. Yeah, but uh, it's a spo story spoilers. I guess I'll just kind of leave, uh, leave alone because I can't remember too many of them, so... Uh, I guess that's the spoiler policy for this series. Okay, I heard her go hey again. No, oh, it looks shitty. It doesn't have any paint or nothing. Oh, well. But, at any rate, um, yeah, so, I, I do remember having to go into this place, like, six times, I think. It's like, five or six times throughout the course of the game. It's ridiculous. But, either way, that's just the beginning. Not much really happened. Poor Tetra got kidnapped right fucking away. Really sucks, but, eh, whatever. It would have been nice to have a bit more Tetra, because she is one of the better, better Zeldas, but what can you do? So yeah, I'm sorry about the control situation. I, again, there's really not much I can do about it, because I gotta use the mouse. But uh, yeah, not much else to say. Just getting started, tutorial shit, and starter stuff. Best character in the game is going to be introduced next time, Linebeck. He is, he is the best. But either way, that's all for now. See you next time. Bye-bye.